everyone, it's good to see you again. I'm back with another LearnDash video and today we're going to be talking about one of my favorite features of LearnDash. It's an add-on called Achievements and what it allows you to do is reward your students for all their hard work while at the same time boosting engagement. So here, let me show you what we're going to do today. We'll be creating a trigger so that when students enroll in a course, they're awarded an achievement and a badge, in this case the Self-Starter Award. Okay, you ready? All right, let's do this thing then. So the first step in our process is we're going to be installing the Achievements add-on for LearnDash. So to do so, we're going to hover over LearnDash, click on Add-ons, and here there are a wide variety of add-ons you can choose from, and I'll be covering some of these in later videos. But like I said, today we're going to focus on Achievements. So for under LearnDash Achievements, we're going to click Install Now. Click Activate Plugin. All right, so now you'll see that there's a new entry in the LearnDash menu called Achievements. So go ahead and click on that. And now click on Add New Achievement. All right, so here's the interface for uh, adding an achievement. So it consists of several, uh, several elements. There's the title of the achievement, the message that's going to be uh, given to them in the form of a pop-up. There's an image, so you can select a badge to uh, award them. And the most importantly are the triggers. As you can see here, there are a number of triggers for, uh, for awarding an achievement. There are WordPress tr triggers such as Rogers registration, logging in. So if you want to encourage your users to you know, re-log in and complete their courses, you can choose that. Or and there's also Learn Dash triggers. So there's when people enroll into a group or a course, or when they complete a course or a lesson. Uh, there's really something for everything there. So we're going to be creating an achievement based on uh, somebody enrolling into a course. So we'll select that option. And so we'll, now we need to title our achievement. So we'll call it the Self Starter Award. Okay, that's good. So now we need to select an image for, our, for the badge that we'll be awarding. So under image, click on select image. And here's a variety of, to uh, choose from. You can also upload your own if you'd like. But I like this one here, this little green ribbon. I think that's suitable for, uh, for starting off. So we've, had our, uh, we've entered our title, we've entered our message, we've chosen an image, we've chosen a trigger. So now we just need to select uh, what course, if there's a specific course you want to award this for, or if it's just any course. So in this case, we're going to select all courses. And um, there's also um, points that you can award based on these achievements. Points can be used to purchase cor courses if you so desire. And the last but not least are the occurrences. So this is the number of times that this award can be granted to a user. If you um, leave it at zero, that means there's unlimited awards for them. So every time they enroll into a course, they'll receive this. However, I just want to award this this one time. So I'm going to change this to one. Click Publish. All right, so now we've got our um, achievement created. So let's just take a, take a look at a course and we'll see what happens. All right. All right, so I'm at my course website, so all I need to do now is register and enroll in a course to see the achievement. So I'm going to scroll down, choose this course here, click on Login to Enroll. I'll register an account. Click register. Now, as soon as I click on take this course, we'll see the uh, see the badge. There we go. It's the self starter award. So that's how you can uh, reward your students for uh, for all their hard work. So, like I said, there's so many triggers to choose from. So why not get out, go out there and explore and uh, award some achievements to your students. 
So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're actually looking to uh, start with LearnDash and set it up and install it for the first time, you might want to check out my video. I cover everything from start to finish. I'll get you up and running in less than two hours. But in the meantime, thank you for watching. Just hit subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.